Hello everyone, my name is Luchara, and this is Eco Global Survival, my single player Let's Play. I uh, might as well start with a uh, meteor update, 22 days, 13 hours, all kinds of time yet. In the last episode, we built this workshop, and we put this, uh, oh, what is it called, electronics assembly down. And now we realize what we need going forward. We need to make some copper wire, that's fine, we can make that. We need gold flakes, that is different. We do not have gold yet, so we're going to have to find gold today. That's got to be one of our priorities. Uh, fiberglass is another thing we're going to need, um, which uses glass, obviously, and plastic. So we make both of those, but we're going to have to continue pumping both of those out. Uh, another thing we're going to need, uh, this substrate is used in advanced and basic circuits. So that uses fiberglass and epoxy. So we need glass, and we need to keep our oil refining going all the time so those are the big um uh, like initial components we need that we can make right now so that's our priority today we're also going to learn uh, advanced cooking i believe or hmm, other advanced cooking or fertilizers uh, we'll see we'll see how i feel here after i uh are you alive yeah you're alive after i keep going for a little while longer here so i had been looking for gold over here Right here, I, I dug down under here. I haven't found gold yet. I may go out here uh, near the copper mine. I may just dig through the copper mine a little farther and then look for gold. But either way, before I look for gold, I'm going to... Another reason we want fiberglass is so we can get modern tools on the go. If you go to this station here, uh, we can make modern tools with fiberglass and steel. We have steel, obviously including the modern rock gel, though. What is this? A combustion engine. So let's uh, see what we need for a combustion engine. Assume that's here, probably. Yeah. Well, I can make a combustion engine right now. So let's queue that up. And, uh, yeah, so we're going to move some glass over to this stockpile so that we can make fiberglass get out of the way. Seriously. Don't make me kill you. Too slow. You're dead. Eventually. Really? Was that not a headshot? There we go. It's actually good because I kind of need meat. I've used uh, a lot of my meat to make the uh, prime roasts or whatever they're called. I, I did too much prepared meat and raw bacon earlier. Now I don't need them, but I'm all out of meat. Anyway, so that's the plan for this episode. I'm going to put a little cut in here and I'm going to get to it. All right, so... You know how I just said that I have too much prepared meat? I realize there is a use for prepared meat. Um, and also right now we are not exactly balanced on our food intake. Uh, we're a little heavy on the fat, <laughs> low on the protein, which is tough to get protein without fat. And our vitamins are ahead of our carbs. We need carbs and protein. Now look at this. Pirozoc, Pirozoc. I'm not sure. I pronounce that, I'm sure I'm pronouncing it wrong, but hey, that's a lot of protein. I mean, there is some fat and a fair amount of carbs, and it uses a whole lot of prepared meat. Perfect, I can get rid of this prepared meat. And fungus, I have some fungus kicking around apparently, and some pastry dough. I don't have a lot of that, but I can make more quite easily. So I'm just going to queue up uh, some Perozox, Perozox. I don't know how to say it. I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing it wrong, if that's like if it's something real from your culture it may be a made up word that the game devs made i have no idea but anyway so that's good i've been hoping to find something so that means i don't need to take advanced cooking because like elk tacos wouldn't be bad that's a nice balanced meal i was thinking about it but i think i'm going to hold off on advanced cooking for now i think i may do fertilizer search but that i have the skill point available but it may not be this episode. I got a lot to do this episode. A lot of moving stuff around. So where is my car? Right over here. So let's... Can we back this up without going off the side? These mirrors need to be functional. <laughs> Honestly. It make my life a lot easier. So I'm going to back it up to where I have the glass. And move some glass over. There's the glass. Alright. Nobody needs to watch me do this. So I will be back. So in order to make a bunch of glass, to make a bunch of fiberglass, I've been making quick lime glass, because that's the most efficient one. It's more efficient than glass. 
uh, but it goes through a lot of sand. And I don't feel like going to the beach and shoveling out sand particularly. So what I'm doing is I've just been coming down here and just clearing out the sandstone bit by bit, throw it in here, go upstairs, grind it up, and then turn the crushed stuff into sand. It's been working uh, somewhat, I guess. Oh, and there's some more here I can do as well. So, I mean, it's just easier. I don't have to go get it from anywhere. Oh, there's some here. Is that going to be... I'm just wondering if that's close enough for the... Oh, yeah, no, it is. It is perfect. So, yeah, so that's uh, one of the things that I've been doing to try to try to stay busy, try to be efficient here while everything else goes. So I am making fiberglass right now. So once that's done, I'm going to go up and I'm going to get myself some modern tools. Looking forward to that. And then we will uh, then we will go looking for gold. Oh, hey, look, some crushed iron. I will not say no to crushed iron, that's for sure. All right, so by the time I come back, we will have uh, modern tools ready to go. And we were going to go... Uh, We'll go prospecting for gold. Should be fun. All right, so I have modern tools. You got, including a new bow, composite bow, modern pickaxe, modern shovel, modern hammer, modern axe, modern scythe, and the modern rock drill. There's also a modern hoe, but that is still in storage. So let's just go down what we already dug out, and we will see if this drill, uh, I'm assuming it goes farther than the other one. The other one went 15. Let's see how far this one goes, and let's see what that tells us, if anything. Does it go further, or faster, or both, is my question. Well, it doesn't look like it's going much faster. Oh, you nice, nice. I don't know if the G, I would think the G is silent there. Nice. I don't know. Let's see how far it goes. I'm thinking at least 20, if not 25. And I don't see any gold. Deep crust. Okay, so we, we hit the bottom there. Interesting. So what if we go this way? I'm assuming it's just going to be granite and maybe uh, maybe some nice, nice, whatever. However you say that. Let's see how far it goes. I'm assuming 25. No. Oh, look at that. Gold ore. Gold ore. Nice. I'm glad I didn't stop at 25. All right, that is a ways away, but that kind of works because I would have to get a ramp down from way the heck up here anyway. So I'll just leave this little, uh, whatever you want to call this, uh, Shaft, mine shaft, I guess it's shaft, hole, whatever, there, and then I can extend the road out this way. I think I got enough room between. How many hexes are we looking at between this stockpile? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, so it's perfectly five, so I'll just go straight across and then start digging down. And hopefully we can, by the time we get deep enough, the gold is there. Oh my god, this is so polluted over here feel sorry for these plants like seriously i don't want to do it but i got to shoot this meteor down or you die anyway i mean you're you're done either way plants so don't blame me for polluting i'm trying to save you in the long run save some of you <laughs> i guess not all of you save as many as i can all right with that said that's a it's gonna be a big project <laughs> it may not i may not finish it this episode because that's gonna be a lot of digging but that gives us lots of crushed ore for asphalt, <laughs> for sure. And there's some limestone there to start, but it's going to be mostly shale and, well, and dirt for a while. Yeah, what's with all the dirt there? Like, let's, what? how far does the dirt go? So I don't want to have to go through a bunch of dirt. Why are you not going through the dirt for me? Clay, 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 clay. It's clay for days. All right, well, we got to do what we got to do. I'd rather dig through useful things like this, but kind of makes sense to just go straight in, right? Because this is where our road is. Unless we want to go straight in over here. 
It's the only other real option I have. So let's see. Let's see how far the play goes in here. Ooh, limestone, sandstone, limestone, limestone, limestone. Of course, at this point, we'd already be down. But okay, yeah. So we're going to go over here instead, I think. Gonna have to get some ramps going though down ASAP. And maybe make some way so I can actually jump out of here <laughs> without failing. Alright, so we know what we need to do now. Obviously, we're gonna leave that shaft there. So I'm gonna go right down. So the gold was 26 in, right? So if we are at 199, 24, 32. So if it's 25 in, it would be 174, 24, 32. Let's write that down. All right. So I will be back with some progress of the gold mine, hopefully soon. All right. Well, the gold mine project has officially begun. We're going five wide. We're not messing around with lines on this one. This is just a mine shaft. Uh, so yeah, we're into some limestone and sandstone, which is nice because we can make use of this. Truck's actually full <laughs> of limestone and sandstone. Sandstone? Sandstone. So we're going to go back. We're going to make useful things out of that. See if I can not rhubarb the truck here. Would be great. So this is going to be a lot of trips. It's going to take quite a while. Uh, I'm just hoping I don't go insane. This... <laughs> oh, oh, did you just kill that poor rabbit? Oh, that's a shame. Mm, good chance to test my new bow. Oh, you died. That's too bad. Um, that's heartbreaking, truly. So yeah, so... Oh, I rhubarbed it. Oh, can't save it. Can't save it. Nice, look at that. I keep forgetting that that... <laughs> I can go off the side by the store stockpiles there. Alright, so let's get this stuff in here. Let's get it crushed up and make things out of it. See, so anyway. As I was saying, it's going to take me quite a while. To do to dig out this mine for like obviously but that's fine it gives us something to do and in the meantime we uh should probably go move some oil around because we're gonna need a lot more oil by the looks of things i wish i could see over these things <laughs> that would be great oh well, hey look at that i didn't do anything bad I'm getting better with the truck, I gotta say. I haven't screwed up in a while. Alright, so I'm gonna go move oil around and, uh, oh, wait, better crush those up while I'm here. So this is making sand right now. So let's crush up. Oh, wherever I put that is not linked. Where did all the limestone go? There. Oh, apparently I put it up. Not where I thought I was putting it. Anyway, doesn't matter. It's getting crushed either way. That's all that really matters. As is this sandstone. And let's queue up some uh, some asphalt while we're here. Assuming I have the things. Yeah. I have enough things. So this is what's going to be. It's just going to be back and forth, making asphalt, digging out the mine, moving glass around, moving oil around. Pretty much be the rest of the episode, so I'll just come back to you occasionally with an update. And, uh, yeah. We'll keep doing that until we hit gold, basically. Alright, the, uh, mine project continues. We're a little deeper now. We're into shale now. Which is less useful than limestone and sandstone. So that's, uh, kind of unfortunate. Um, I mean, it's still useful. We can use it to make asphalt. But, the thing is, limestone and sandstone can also be used to make asphalt, but... Limestone can also be used in cement in to make quick lime for quick lime glass. Sandstone can be turned into sand. So they're just more flexible. Oh well there's we do have some limestone here. So I guess it's not all shale all the time, which is nice. Actually, out of curiosity, well, let's see. Let's see here. Shale. Oh, clay. Oh, limestone though. But I mean, by the by the time we get this deep in, we'll we'll be lower. Okay, so a bunch of limestone there, in theory. So that's cool. That's cool. Cool, cool, cool. So yeah, so that's where we are now. We're a little deeper. Still got quite a ways to go, obviously. But we're getting there. 
Oh, hello, friend. <laughs> Ugh, clay. I don't really want to have to deal with clay, <laughs> preferably. But yeah, it is what it is, right? Not a big deal. Not the end of the world. We got to scoop out some clay every now and then. Oh, that's a lot of clay. <laughs> but I know it doesn't go deep, right? It's just one layer of clay. So we can deal with that easily. Yeah, I just want to give an update. Um, yeah, because this is going to take a while. And I will lose my mind if I do it all without an update. <laughs> Pretty sure. All right, so I'm going to keep plugging away here. And I will be back soon. All right, Project Gold Mine Shaft continues. We are making some progress. We got through the, the clay. And then there's a big chunk of just limestone. We already had a full load of limestone that we already took back. Took it down to the uh, to the smelting area to crush up and then turn into quick lime. And now we're getting into a bit of variety pack. There's still a bunch of limestone. There's a little bit of shale. Got some sandstone. Doesn't look like there's a whole lot of sandstone. Well, it might continue on for a little bit at least. I would much rather sandstone and limestone to shale anyway. But, you know, I'll take what I can get. It's all good. We'll, we will make use of it all, I'm sure, in the long run. But we still got a long way to go. We are 201.68.51. We got to get to what? 174.24.32. Well, the 32 is less important. So, yeah, so we still got a long way to go. How far have we come? Yeah, we're getting there. We're making good progress. I'm feeling good about this. So anyway, just wanted to uh, update everybody again. I'm going to keep picking away at it, and I will be back. So I just realized a cool trick with the truck. And maybe it's not a, you know, a revelation to most people, but if you're going, it doesn't matter how fast you get going. If you need to stop, just hop out. It stops on a dime. <laughs> just like that. Which is pretty handy. So this is how far we are in the gold mine. Uh, we're getting down there. It's funny, uh, we went through like different phases. Limestone here, then shale. There was some sandstone obviously here as well. Then we went through the little dirt phase. Back to the limestone. Now we're into the shale again. Looks like it's going to be all shale for a while. So we got a ways to dig yet. We are a long ways away. We go down a little, not a little more, quite a bit more this way. And then we're going to have to cut this way. Um to get where we want to go because the gold that we discovered and I mean there could be more down here I mean who knows I mean god there could be gold straight right below me right now for all I know I doubt it but we're going to go to where we know there's gold for sure not going to play around with hoping there's gold you know in x or y direction we're going to go where we know it is we have the location written down so we know how to get there so that's the plan um, so that's going to be all for this video. We got we got quite a bit of this done. Um, so we're going to continue working on it next video. I think in the next video, uh, to break things up, other than just mine updates, we're also going to learn a new skill or two. Uh, I'm going to say probably advanced cooking. And maybe we'll get into fertilizers and mess around with farming a little more. Uh, if, not in, if not in the next video, then the one after. It'll be soon. Because, I mean, let's be honest, just straight mining this out... It's, it's, it, I'm sure it makes for boring <laughs> uh, videos compared to most, you know, or it would get boring if I did nothing but this for, you know, three straight videos. And, and if I just did one video to do this whole mine, it would take me three days anyway. So I might as well just mix up and get some other little videos in there. I figure was, is the best way to go. So that's the plan for the next couple of videos. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, please leave a like, uh, subscribe if you haven't already. Be good to each other. And I'll see you in the next one.